Hi everybody, uh, this is Sean, Surfing Hawk. Um, I'm here to do a review on a Doka. Um, I have my air conditioning on right now. Um, I don't know if it's going to cause a problem in the sound. Uh, but um, it's hot. So. <laughs> um, the Doka I want to do is uh, one that I just received not too long ago as a gift. And um, it's a cold. And I normally don't smoke colds um, that much. Um, and it's not really so much a temp thing. It's just that most of my flavors that I like um, when it comes to flavor are uh, of the warm, warm uh, category. Um, and some of them are actually considered an under warm. And some of them are considered an overwarm, um, which just tells you that it's leaning towards either weaker or stronger in a medium and uh, a warm. Uh, but this doka, it's a cold doka. It's a genuine. Uh, it's new to me. I really don't know if it's new on the line. Um, I took a, a, quite a bit of a break. Um, from purchasing Doka um, just due to finances um, but I had um, ordered enough where it lasted um, and now I'm back at it so I'm just trying to kind of update myself on what's new and, and what's not and what and so but um, I got this as a gift in a, in a recent order from medwalk.com um, and it's called uh, Morning enjoyment. Um, I guess I have already smoked this. Um, I do like it. Um, and um, it's mostly for taste uh, when it comes to the cold. Um, but there is a little hint of something that I'll get into when I, when I smoke it. Um, I can tell you that with a cold, for me, I have a harder time taking a power hit on a cold than I do an extra hot. And the reason why is because the colds tend to be a darker leaf tobacco. And by knowing tobacco, not just through doka, um, your darker leaf tobaccos tend to be richer and robust in flavor. Which means they almost have like a thickness to them. Um, like a cream to a coffee almost, I guess. Um, and that really builds up on me and, um, it'll make me cough. Um, I'm not kidding yet. I mean, I'm gonna try and do my normal hits, but, uh, so far with this, I have not done a power hit. Um, just mainly because, uh, I mean, I kind of did a half one and I coughed and it just, uh, it's just something about cold with me, and it doesn't have to do with the, the temp so much. It has to do with the type of, of, of tobacco leaf that's actually used. Um, but yeah, I'm going to pretty much smoke just the way I smoke it. Um, a lot of times I, I do use matches. Um, I use a lighter um, out of convenience. Um, and especially right now where I have, you know, the air conditioner on and, and a fan, um, it's it just, it's hard when you want to smoke your doka and smoke it right and your mask goes out. Uh, so for convenience sake, I just use the lighter and uh, try to do the review as best as possible. Alright, this is morning enjoyment and uh, I'm going to get into smoking this. Taking a little time, not because I got the buzz going, um, 
but because it had that grab on me, um, I knew only to go uh, three tokes in and uh, quit because it got thick on me real quick. Um, real thick, real robust, real um, just a rich, a rich tobacco. Um, it's a very good flavor. Um, it's more, I think it's just a stri strictly just a, a straight tobacco. Um, I'm not sure if I'm picking up a sweetness um, from something added um, because I don't know a lot about this doka because I just got it. Um, but it could be just the sweetness of the tobacco um, itself, um, which I find enjoyable. Um, I do like to smoke this in the morning, um, as labeled, uh, just because it is a cold doka. And uh, it, uh, if I'm choosing a cold, um, it's usually because of the fact that it's gentle to start off with. Um, if I go with a warm, I go with one that's usually not fuzzy. Um, kind of build up and just uh, work my way through the day uh, and enjoy myself as I go along. Um, with uh, sometimes, uh, you know, uh, you know, I will start my day with a hot doka um, for personal reasons, um, but for the most part, I don't. Um, just because it can kind of dampen everything else you do with it within that day um, in terms of your smoking. Um, it kind of brings you to a level of feeling that buzz and it just kind of tapers everything down uh, for the rest of the day unless you take a good break, uh, like a good long break. Uh, so that's why I, I try to build up. It's more for my enjoyment and my pleasure. Um, and uh, that's just the way I do it. I'm going to finish up this morning enjoyment, um, cold, genuine, and, uh, I like it so far. Still got that thick grab on me, but that's just how cold it affects me. Um, smooth this snow, though. Uh, it's it's really pretty smooth. Um, got a tiny bit of an itch to it. Not bad at all. Um, it's definitely one um, that I would recommend to start your day off with. Um, I mean, the way it's labeled, morning enjoyment. Um, it does fit it perfectly. Um, for me, where I, I like the, the straight tobaccos um, a lot, um, it's nice to have a cold that's uh, really kind of not on the flavor side, where uh, a lot of your colds are. Um, I like a, a, a tobacco, just a natural tobacco taste, uh, especially in the morning before I... Um, you know, douse my palate full of flavor. Um, so it, it's just a, for me, it's a nice way to start off the day. Um, it's a well tasting doka um, for a uh, straight tobacco. It's a little bit on the sweet side. It's not that harsh at all. Uh, it's pretty smooth. Um, and in terms of a buzz, um, with the cold, I don't classify it as a buzz, um, I more classify the colds and a lot of your warms, um, more on the, um, I don't know, not really buzz, but aspect of a glow, um, where you just have that, that feel good feeling going through you, and, uh, you know, it's not really, um, something that, you know, where you're buzzing around or anything, it's just a, a slight feeling you get um, that's a glow to me, um, where it says, yeah, you smoked a doka, um, not an intense one, but one to uh, 
if you take the time to really um, appreciate um, your tobacco and whatever you enjoy, um, you pick up different things about it. And uh, it's just something I noticed with the Nicole that I, I actually really kind of like. I like that gentle, just glow feeling from a cold, um, where it's not a buzz at all. It's just a... Uh, I'm awake feeling, and uh, I feel pretty decent. Um, in terms of rating a cold, um, it's kind of difficult where I don't smoke a lot of colds. Um, I would say that, you know, for the first thing, the taste, um, in a 1 to 10 scale, um, as a natural tobacco, straight tobacco taste, um, I would give it an eight, uh, a strong eight. It, it's real. It's on the and it, cause it's basically because of the smooth side of it um, and the sweetness, um, and that you know leads me into the you know the, the harshness and stuff. And uh, it, it's not harsh at all. It's um, it's nice. Um, can have a little bit of an itch, but it, it's not a major problem at all. Um, it's kind of one that just you know, kind of says, yeah, you, you know, it's tingling a little bit, but no need to cough. Um, and the buzz, um, like I said, I don't classify the cold as a buzz, more as a glow. Um, just an overall feeling of just, you know, I'm alive and uh, I feel good. Um, nothing really will rock in. I don't like to start off my day that way unless it's for a reason. Um, an overall score, um, I would give this one. Um, I'm actually debating right now whether to give it an 8 or a 9. And the 8 definitely, um, in terms of just the all-around qualities, um, I'm thinking about a nine because it's it's uncommon for me to come across a cold that is really just a, a straight tobacco, um, and I like straight tobacco, and I don't find that in a lot of the colds. Um, and so, for with me, it, it would be a nine, but for overall, just in general, I would give it an eight. Um, it lives up to its name. Uh, it is enjoyable. Um, I highly recommend it for the morning. Um, start off your day if you don't want to start off severe. Uh, and then just uh, enjoy a good tobacco, good doka. And uh, it's morning enjoyment. It's by Medblock Doka. Uh, you can find them at medblock.com. And uh, my appreciation and thanks goes out to them and to the community that helped teach me about Doka. And um, that's why I'm doing this. Uh, you know, I'm grateful. Uh, and I, when I appreciate things, I try to let, you know, those that I appreciate things from or them personally, I try to let them know. Um, I think that's important in life, you know. Uh, I think these days, you know, it's hard to come by uh, the good things. Uh, rather than the bad things, unfortunately. But yeah, all around, that's a, it's a nice, enjoyable doka. It's it, it lives up to its name. Um, and for me, as a natural tobacco smoker, I just I'm glad it's available because just of it being a straight tobacco. Um, well, uh, I know this video was a little bit long because. Uh, it's just the fact that I normally don't smoke a cold, um, and I wanted to explain why and, and the difference for me personally, um, but I do hope that it was informational, I do hope you got something out of it, and uh, I hope you have a good day, alright, bye.